My right, guys, just uh, programming this uh, Kenwood TK 760H here tonight. I got a bunch of uh, frequencies for our neck of the woods here on the east end of the island. Um, and now I've got the uh, V1 GT, V1 RCR, V1 NTV, V1 TCR, 146, 520. Uh, VO1 FRR, VO1 TBR, VO1 ELF, VO1 BT, VO1 IC, 146.5, 510, 530, 540, 55, 60. Um, this radio <laughs> is mint. It still got the protective uh, screen still on it. The protective plastic for the LCD is still on this thing. Uh, still got the original box, microphone, bracket. Everything. Even got the original uh, Kenwood uh, Land Mobile certificate, warranty certificate. Not even filled out. <laughs> and the uh, manual still in the box there. That's pretty cool uh, to find at least, the radio got to be at least 20 years old. To find a 20 year old radio like this, mint, and never programmed. It had two factory default frequencies on it. And uh, I just just had to show it to you. The radio is like mint. It's crazy for it to be to, to come across it in such condition. Even has the uh, the optional accessory uh, connector, which is harder and harder to find. That there is a nice uh, nice option. They give you the option for a bunch of different uh, different features that the radio can give you. Uh, it's a breakout connector, basically. Like an accessory type uh, connector, like the uh, 20 the DB25 COM port that you find on the ICOM radios and whatnot. But uh, very cool little radio. It's like say mint. Very very rare to come across a TK760 of this vintage in mint condition, unused and even unprogrammed. That's crazy. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so I've got. Um, I've got the uh, monitor put on here. Uh, that button's not programmed. So we got scan right here. And we got the uh, scan add delete here. The radio can scan without a microphone. I've got her programmed so she can do that without having a microphone attached to her. Just press scan button and away she goes. And in programming, I have all the channels already have them added into, into the scan list already, ready to go. And uh, yeah. And we've got a encode of 100 put on V1 RCR. It is an encode code that is uh, RCRs after putting on it in the last few years. Um, I think I actually programmed V1 RCR a few years ago. It was an old ten, old uh, Kenwood repeater. I think it was a NX710. Not 100% sure, but uh, it's that type type design anyway it was it was a beast but uh, yeah and there we have it anyways and oh yes I had one question from one viewer very recently about the programming cable for this particular radio and they were asking me about the USB plug why I'm using the USB plug with the programming cable uh, the USB cable, the USB plug is to provide 5 volts DC for the circuit board. Without 5 volts on the circuit board, this programmer will not work. And there's a bunch of uh, modifications on that board or on that uh, programming cable that had to be done in order to work with this. And uh, once again, I had to add, I had to thank Ray, Mr. Ray over there in Ireland. Uh, Mr. TechQuest, um, he provided the instructions for me to how to pro how to modify that programming cable to work properly. Because when I bought that programming cable off of eBay, as it was, it did not work with the radio. It would not work at all. And uh, I took a quick peek at the board, found a few little things that had to be changed. And uh, with his help, we got the cable working. So, there you have it. Anyways, that's volume. It can go all the way to zero. And you got channel selecting right here. 16 channels. And 
unfortunately this radio do not uh, is not alphanumeric in other words I can't assign channel names on the uh, 760 other than channel 1 through channel 16 the uh, newer version of the radio can certainly do it this version cannot unfortunately but uh, so you need a you need a cheat sheet to go with the radio <laughs> but anyways just a quick little video I wanted to uh, show this awesome uh, awesome find and uh, like I say very rare to come across a vintage radio in mint condition never programmed never installed that's uh, that's pretty cool anyway guys chat later